I'm Dave, this day is a weird project, and I am here with Into the Breach Advanced Edition, and this could be the first of our Custom Squad Challenge videos, and this first one is something I like to call Oops All Science, <laughs> and these are the mechs we're coming, we're bringing in. We're going to get the Swap Mech, which exchanges places with something else, or it swaps places, I guess, because I can't say exchange for that one, because this is the exchange mech. Uh, it swaps two other things and then we have the control mech which makes something else move um, the three of these together have very little attack power um, the exchange mech can actually get one damage uh, if it moves an enemy this is not a very killy squad but it's pretty powerful what time traveler should we use i'm gonna go with camilla vera because she is unaffected by webbing and smoke, which means one of our mechs will always be able to get out of whatever situation. Uh, I'm putting her in the exchange mech because that will allow her to then uh, move and get somebody else out of another dangerous situation if they have to be. So we're gonna get some colors going. I like yellow. We're gonna go yellow for everybody. And away we go. And we're probably just going to do a two island run, try to keep this episode short. So we will go to Archive. Defend the launches, destroy the dam. Destroying the dam is going to be pretty tough, so we're probably going to skip that one. Defend the launches, alright. Only one threat to the launch is there, um, and honestly, we can do this, and then uh, not only are we protecting the satellite, but we're doing some actual damage there. Uh, let's go ahead, let's do this to get some damage on the Scion, and there's not a lot to do for, for the control mech to do this turn, so we're just going to move them closer driving that that's Claire and driving the swap mech Michaela Zhang all right turns. all right let's see two threats to the satellite I think a real simple solution is just to swap these two, because then this one will be shooting off to this side, and this one will be shooting down this way. But I want to do it from this position, because I don't want this guy's sideways shot to hit me. So I'm probably going to take control mech over here, and have this guy... Oh, you know what? We'll, have him... we'll put him here. Oh no, that's the wrong spot. Never mind. We'll put him over here. Work on them mountains. Alright, that's safe now, and we can do this. We'll get the uh, Scion to um, get caught in the rocket blast. Sweet. So yeah, no kills as of yet. <laughs> um, I like this. Shoving that in the way there. Um, this is great. Uh, we want to do. Could also do, let's say, this. for the back. Okay, only one threat to the rocket. Threat to a building. That building's safe now. safe. 
Okay. and protect the coal plant. Sounds good. Got air support. That plays real well with this team. <laughs> Manipulate them into there. Okay, got a time pop. That'd be nice. Alright. So, why don't we change... These two. Get some damage on the Scion. Um, here. I don't think we actually want to move this guy though. And uh, yeah, just play some games. <laughs> oh, here we can do this. There, now we're now we're nice and spread out for next turn. Stand behind. That's good. Uh, you're the only threat to anything we really care about. Okay, go swim, swim. Uh, we could do. Let's just. Look at that. <laughs> um, not this guy. When this thing dies, it'll give one extra XP because it's got uh, higher health than this one. Oh, that's interesting. So, they're worth more if they're killed while the green scion is active. I didn't know that. Okay. I mean, if you're gonna, <laughs> if you're gonna do that, let me just get out of your way. Seems good. All right, made it out. Coal plant protected. Time pod protected. And the battle with less of four mech damage. We got a reactor core. I think probably we're gonna go with uh, the swap mechs first. At least, at least getting one extra range on it before we start looking elsewhere. Um, heal ally is nice. Hurt enemy will definitely be nice. Um, and these, you know, additional moves are good too. Um, it's just good to, to expand swap mech as soon as possible because having it have to be adjacent at first is a little rough. I think we're going to go with this one, defend the artillery support, protect the coal plant. Alright, excellent. 
Uh, once again, the Vec have given us pretty simple choices here. Oops. Let's reset here. <laughs> I got confused on who was who. You! I thought I was you. There we go. Okay, there we go. Okay, now yeah, we got a couple threats here. This is threatening our coal plant, this is threatening one of our buildings. Um, luckily, exchange mech. So good at solving two problems at once. And let's do that. Swap. Okay. Did pretty good. Oh, threatening our, our little buddy. And that. Uh, okay, he's attacking downward. Get you over there. Okay. Yeah, I don't see a reason to use the swap mech for anything. Defend the armored train. Armored trains are neat. They have a <laughs> literally a point of armor, so they're much easier to keep safe. Um, like none of these guys would actually be able to damage it. I think the only problem. Not sure if he. Okay, he does not break if he <laughs> runs over somebody, like the regular train. That's pretty cool. Okay. Building, threatening me. Very little to be concerned about here. Oh, we'll use exchange mech. Exchange mech is going to exchange friend as well as foe. There we go. Haha! -ha. Swap mech does not have some need to have something to swap with. They can swap with thin air. Or thick air. Okay, so. Threatening the train, but not really. Threatening the train, but not really. Can be ignored. Where are you at? Okay, actually, I kind of want to do something like... This. Who's first? He's first, so he'll do a damage there. Um, and then he'll get a shot by his buddy. Anything we want to do with... Control left? Right. Put him way over there so he's got less options next turn. Swap mech. Swaps! So threat to a building, threat to a building if we get out of the way, but we could also swap these two and then they're fine. So yeah, why don't we do that? Okay. Bring the 
this guy over here. But just for fun, let's do this one. Get a little more HP. Alright, ready to go train. I gotta say, the armored train mission that, that showed up in Advanced Edition, it's kind of, like, it's funny, but it's it, it takes a lot of the threat away of that mission. Okay, so we are destroying... Well, so this is the downside to this group, is the odds that we'll be able to actually kill the boss in any of these missions is kind of low. <laughs> um, we can do we can do stuff like this. Oops. Oh, wrong one. You know where we get put it in front of one of the uh, bad ones, and that's fine. There's nothing wrong with that. This and he takes care of one of those eggs. Uh, yeah, the only other thing I could do is, I mean, I could have this thing go... Oh, that's actually probably a good idea. I'm gonna do this. That way he takes care of a spider as he would have taken care of an egg. And blocks a spawn. That's probably better. Okay, that makes things harder. Okay. Do this. That way the boss is still taking some damage. To save that building, okay, I'm gonna have to do this. Use the movement. Control back to get a little bit of extra movement out of swap back. There we go. So as you can see, it's real slow going to try to defeat the bosses with this group. And that's okay. <laughs> and especially with something like the spider leader <laughs> she's just stuck swap like this uh, we save this building control mech can't do a lot for us except maybe like this that's probably good I'd rather save buildings than try to kill the boss at this point. So we'll just do this. Alright, so we're, we're risking, I think, two points of damage here. Oh, wow. So lucky. Okay, there's just no way we're gonna get five damage on the boss this turn. Well, we can do this to save the build. Get another damage there. Here first. Just cause. Go over there. Alright, so tower protector. No power loss. Thanks to two very lucky grip defense rolls. But, boss got away. And you know what? We knew that going into this raid. Got an upgrade on our swamp guy. He's probably the, the easiest one to get kills when you've got stuff like water. Um, so yeah, no damage to repair. That's fantastic. Um, I think we'll probably get a couple cores just to upgrade our abilities and then increase the defense once. Uh, let's see, that's a science class, but I can't imagine that's better than anything we've got. So, yeah. Oh, this is nice. Since that's our, our best way of getting kills most of the time. Uh, but, I stand by my decision. I think cores are better just to improve our abilities. So we're going to put one into moving for you. And probably... 
probably go ahead and do one here, and I'm not super concerned about heal allies, so we'll just do health for now. Nah, movement. Movement's better. And that way we're going to build up to hurt enemies so that we can at least have some damage capability. Alright, let's head out. Let's do Detritus. Okay, destroy the Acid Storm Controller, destroy egg sacs, defend the train, protect the batteries, kill at least seven enemies. Um, nah. I think we'll do this one. Everybody's got acid. Come on there, since she has to walk. All right, we need to destroy these two things, and we need to destroy this thing. Okay. So we will go ahead and, yep, yeah, just to make the egg sack more accessible later. The uh, armor means nothing if the guys have acid on them. So that's... it's fine to let that Scion be for a bit. Alright, so we've destroyed one of the targets we need to destroy. We've got two more. This egg sac, which this is going to take care of. And this storm controller. And we need someone attacking... up... or... Thing that will explode. There we go. Okay, that's second egg sack. Take some damage there, sorry Camilla. Here's another opportunity to put some damage on that. If we swap correctly like this. There we go. I'm gonna have you who's first? You're first. And we'll just <laughs> just stand there. Oh, here we go. Let's do this guy. Haha. <laughs> damage left on that. And we have a lovely dude attacking upward. Now the question is, I think actually we want to do this. Because that makes sure that this doesn't go off and get that building. And why not jump in there. Okay, controller destroyed, goals fulfilled, moving on, oh, I missed it, so if you ever see one of these glowing mountains, uh, attack it, do it, you'll get a little surprise, I think I already have all of the surprises. Okay, let's see. Defend the power plants, block Vex spawning. We're not too bad at orchestrating that. Uh, but I like stars. Defend the train, protect the emergency battery. Let's do that. Okay. Alright, well, a lot of this is bad. Not gonna lie think probably we want to swap the bomb with one of our people so that one of our people can then get out of the way and make one of these people do something. You get over there. Do here. It's not bad. Okay.
We're gonna use a control mech. Okay, so that covers that. You're gonna blow this up and damage the train. Oh, here's a good idea. Do this. There we go. Alright. Oh no! You're in the way! Okay, reset turn. Can't have that. We cannot def destroy the train. Control mech needs to be here or here. Oh, so smooshed. Everything is smooshed. We don't have to save him, we just move the bomb, right? If, if he hits something that doesn't explode, <laughs> right? Then that works. Do it from here. Switch it with this thing. That way he'll smack back on it. Yeah, I don't know how to get... <laughs> I don't know how to get this out of there without also getting something hit. Yeah. I'm gonna have to get him to do some other stuff. And take the damage to the train. Oh, and we die. <laughs> I forgot, this train kills things. Okay, so we've messed everything up, all of the things. It happens. Oh. Did we, we didn't turn heal ally on, did we? No. Oh, that would have fixed this. Okay. Well, we can do this. So sad. Insulted. Alright, that's okay. Mistakes happen. Very tight situation. Very hard to get out of that. If you're if you're on the instant replay and you can see a way that I could have got out of that one, let me know in the comments, because I really would I would really like to know. Uh, kill four enemies inflicted with acid. So we are not super killy. But four we might be able to pull off. We might be able to pull off. I'm going to go for it. Because we're going to want some stars. Uh, okay. And we get this acid tank that helps us do it. Okay, he's already... Acided himself, thank you. So like we do this. This guy down. Yeah, I think I think she's fine right there. Alright, so that'll be one. That's handy, isn't it? <laughs> uh, so yeah, he's gonna take care of that. That'll be great. Uh, let's let's do this one. That's good. Get you down. Yeah. Okay. So we'll just go with this. turns to do it. Oh, this is great. Yeah. We'll just do that. Like that. Yeah. I'm gonna make him gooey. Back in position. Alright, that's pretty good. Dead. 
there. <laughs> a little sloppy, but got the job done. Camilla leveled up. Invulnerable. Uh, I think that be, yeah, it does not die when the mech is defeated. That's nice. Uh, I mean, either way, we're only getting one star out of any of these. Probably this one. It gives us a, a fairly decent grid defense boost if we pull it off. Block back spawning three times. I think we can manage that. Alright, so there's two. Take a damage to do this, and we'll get two of our spawn blocks. Okay. I would love to have him be, let's say, here. And then we've arranged for somebody else to be here. Yeah, I think we can make that work like this. And Camilla doesn't care about smoke. There we go, not too bad there. We can get rid of this nasty thing. Bye bye. One thing about all the science mechs is they are kind of fragile. All of you are shooting straight up, so exchanging you with each other doesn't do a lot for us. But this is a nice play. This. I think we're good. Destroy the centipede leader. Alright. Uh, very narrow land pathways for Camilla to work with. Okay. To destroy the leader of the centipedes. One must first. Or the butt, as the case may be. Whoops. He said. <laughs> one one mistake I often make with the exchange bag. so it's in a slightly better position. Yeah. Oh, now we got armor. But he's acided himself, so that's really nice. Okay, so I think if we do something like... Do this. 
Okay, so it's not super great, but he will take a damage from this thing blowing up, which is nice. I'd really like to get one of these guys to nail him. <laughs> uh, maybe that opportunity is now. Yeah. Go here. And then we can... Oop, let's get you out of the way first. Oh, that was terrible. <laughs> Shoot. Well, we're gonna beat it. Yeah. Well, at least we saved the building. Okay, he's down. It's last turn, we've got two things to deal with, two guys to do it with. I think we'll be okay. Yeah. There we go. And Camilla is invulnerable, so that's fine. All right, so there we go. Finish that. Actually beat the boss that time. Not bad. Spend our reputation here. Get cores. Get defense. We're headed for the volcano. We'll do damage enemy. And then, yeah, we'll use the last one for heal ally. That would have come in real handy. <laughs> we lost our other pilot. Uh, all right. So here we go, into the volcano. Oops, all science, coming to fruition. stuff we have to deal with. Alright. Wow. Look at him sign up. I would like to be on the smoosh plan, please. Uh, we would like to kill this Scion thing, though. <laughs> okay, yeah, so we're going to take some Scion damage. There's no way around it. I'm pretty sure we can get this thing killed. Oops, all science presents. Oops, all environment kills. Oh, we missed him. Yeah, whatever. <laughs> we've, got, we've got health to burn. Oh no, we are all in critical condition now. Its <laughs> mechs are a little fragile. Alright, lava. Now we do have heal allies, so that's handy. Um, if we were to, let's say, do this. Both of them. You go here. And we'll have swap neck repair. Oop, Camilla. It's okay. She can get out of there. As long as she doesn't end her move in the lava. Okay. I like this. Also got a heal in there. That's you. Yeah, why don't you talk to him? Okay. Phase one. 
Not too bad. Lost one power. <laughs> the guy's like, I'm fine up here. Eater. All right. What do we got? We got rocks coming down. So I like the idea I think, of exchange here and here. Do that. Okay, so he's done. We do this. Problem is, I would love to to have this guy walk out of there, but I can't. <laughs> so we'll move this guy instead, and yeah, we're gonna risk a couple damage there. Probably gonna take that, but it is the end of the game. Yep. Still got four. We could exchange the bomb with something else. We could just exchange the bomb in this guy. Yeah, that's not bad. Alright, bomb is safe. This guy here. And then we'll swap. That'll work. Very good. Spawn, that one takes herself out. Okay. We're gonna get the tentacle scion, gets a sh gets a shot in again. Um and this seems like a good idea. And then this. If we take another tentacle hit, <laughs> we are in bad trouble. damage buildings, one damage to the bomb, plus one from the scion, so the bomb will survive. One of us will survive. <laughs> Camilla technically survives. <laughs> I will say, I've done this before, but I did it as a four island victory. Um, having them powered up all the way makes all the difference. So, yeah, we did it. One AI <laughs> driving the control mech gets out, has a few uh, victory beers. But yeah, so that's fun. Oops All Science, one of my faves. Uh, <laughs> thanks to the valiant efforts of Camilla and a robotic autopilot. We did it. All right, so thanks for joining. Uh, next time I've got another one of these planned, but if you have any suggestions for a custom squad that makes an interesting challenge or just a fun run, uh, please leave them in the comments below. Thanks for tuning in and we'll see you next time.